drags Jake Paul on Twitter. We'll tell you what's going on and how Jake Paul responded to the viral tweet. I'm Johnny Burchold and you're watching The Daily Report. Hey, did you know that Gigi Hadid and Zayn Malik are back together? According to E! News, they reunited right before the holidays. The two have had an on-again, off-again relationship for a few years now. They first got together back in 2015 before ending it in 2018, starting it in 2018 again, and then ending it in 2019. And now it's back on and the year is 2020. So a source told E! News, quote, Zayn has been reaching out to Gigi for the last month and she is giving him another chance. She has always loved him and the break between the two was needed. Zayn has been working on his past music and focusing on his health and is in a really good place currently. That's, it's beautiful. Look, self-care, we need to work on ourselves before we can work on others. The source added that everyone in Gigi's family is happy for them as they've always treated him like family. And it's a good thing that the two are back together now because uh, well, how else is Gigi gonna shut down a YouTuber who is trying to come for Zayn on Twitter? On early Sunday morning, Jake Paul decided to start a little drama, as he often sometimes decides to do. Jake and his brother were in Vegas and probably ending their Saturday night festivities when he tweeted, quote, almost had to clap up Zayn from One Direction because he is a little guy and has an attitude and basically told me to f off for no reason when I was being nice to him, dot, dot, dot. Zayn, I know you're reading this. Stop being angry because you came home alone to your big hotel room, ha, ha, ha. Yikes! But I guess Jake didn't get the news that Zayn is back with Gigi. Well, she stepped in immediately to defend her man, writing back, quote, LOL, because he doesn't care to hang with you and your embarrassing crew of YouTube groupies. Home alone with his best friends like a respectful king, because he has me, sweetie. Unbothered by your irrelevant, ugly ass. Go to bed and bam, just like that, Twitter exploded and now we are shutting down 2020. So it seems like Jake really did take Gigi's advice and go to bed because when he woke up, Gigi's tweet had gone extremely viral with many fans tweeting for Gigi to quote, drag him or quote, finish him. So much that on Sunday night, Jake deleted the tweet and then followed it up with a tweet that said, quote, someone needs to take my phone when I'm drunk because I am a idiot. Many Jake Paulers came to his defense tweeting things like, quote, it happens, and quote, still love you though, while others continued to drag him writing, quote, is this the excuse that your PR team and management came up with uh, after many hours? LMAO, it's pretty weak, mate. But we want to know what you guys think. Was Gigi right in how she responded? Should